One of the things that I've learned about traveling is that it is a form of relaxation. It is a form of adventure. Although I have passed this road many times, every single time I look at it, it reminds me of a long time and beauty of God. Traveling is a time where you can just take a break from all the things that have been doing and find pleasure in looking at beautiful things that God has created. I am back on this journey with my family and it was amazing seeing the transformation from when we traveled and how it changed our lives during the process. I was excited, very excited, because normally I love living in my, my space. As a creative, whenever you step out, it gives you ideas. So if you are a creator and maybe you have not been getting lots of ideas, I think you should take a break. I traveled for my grandfather's burial and I started preparing for it. I really did not know and didn't dawn on me that this was real and was happening. I started to turn I started to feel that this was real. You know, there are a lot of things that I could learn from this journey. I learned that life is short. He lived a long life by the grace of God. But we wanted him to stay there. But I learned that that was selfish of him. Because the celebration of his life actually brought us together, brought my family together. And apart from that, the celebration of his life reignited that fire in him. And I, I'm sure I did the same for others to, to love God, to serve God. Because my grandfather was someone who lived his whole life pleasing God. Winning souls, even in the prison yard. This was a bold step. And I was ready to take my... Then we headed to my brother's school where we saw him and saw the beauty of the school environment. He's a boarder, so this ground reminded me of when I was also a boarder and all the training in this place. At this stage of my life, all the training that I attained, I was happy that he was learning to be strong too. I was so excited to see him. I swear my children. So this was him coming. Aji! I know this is why. He coming. I like this. Then we headed back to put our cuts. The road is beautiful. So am I. I could not resist the temptation of recording this white area. The whole area was full of sand and dust. We literally had to close the windows. It looks like snow, guys. <laughs> I 
Anden de gode øre. Almost at the beach. And then we landed in the Port Harcourt City. I hope that you've been able to take something from this video. Like learning that life is too short and that we should live this life pleasing God, the one who created us. I hope that you take that bold step of traveling and leaving your comfort zone.